Hi everyone, today in this video we are going over this mini computer case that's built for Raspberry Pi, so stay tuned. Moving on, after Raspberry Pi being out of stock and overpriced for many months, I was finally able to get my hand on some of them so I can start working on some projects. This is thanks to Yeldermart for sending these to me at a reasonable price. So this case is Pizen by Electro Cookie. It's an aluminum case for Raspberry Pi 4. Before I talk about it, I want to say that I'm not sponsored for this product. Neither I did not get it for free. I paid for it on Amazon. And the only reason I'm creating this video is to make sure that my audience know what type of case this is and whether it's worth it or not. Overall, I like the case because the body is made from aluminum. There are glass uh, panels, but um, inside the case we can see that there is a user manual including how to assemble the case. Everything I'll show you in a bit, how to assemble it step by step. But within the case we have some things. It's the, we have the GPIO extender, meaning that you don't have to connect in your pins into your Raspberry Pi directly but you can connect them from the side for any of your project you want which was a great option it has a cool RGB effect that I'll show you at the end within the case normal fans including one RGB fan and one normal fan comes with the case along with the screwdriver and heat sink so you don't really need an eye starver but if you really want to keep the temperature at ideal level you can also add in an eye starver which I will show you in this video too. But uh, as I'm doing the process, I will explain some other things and then I'll let you watch the process. The heat sink and the fan that came are all right. The fans are perfect actually, but the heat sink is not ideal for keeping your Raspberry Pi temperature under intense loading or if you're trying to run it for a long period of time. So I definitely recommend going for uh, ice tower which I'll later on show it in the video if you also want to look the ice tower individual unboxing and review you can check my other videos in my channel if you're interested in other type of case and raspberry pi definitely check out my channel too don't forget to like and subscribe
I'm really happy with the end results as you can see here it looks great however if you want to keep both the GPIO extender and the ice tower you need to get a special type of screw that's a smaller that's why the screw right here is sticking out but that's not a problem if you like this video please go ahead give it like and subscribe thank you so much for watching this video and have a great day